Hello, my name is Mark Fitzgibbon and welcome to my vlog. A hurmaitif is a person who lives for the pomp. Sex is the oxygen they breathe. And if they don't indulge in frequent coitus, they dry up and quiver like an orchid without water. The hurmait, or mate for short, can also be called a whore, a slut, a gentu, a stave appeal, or a toot vajak. And don't be fooled, a hurmait can look like you or me. They can be beautiful, but usually they look like mountain goats. These tiffs love stealing your man or woman away from you. They know that you are involved with someone, but they just can't put their puss on pause. Bruh, just put your puss on pause, manita man for check. And let's get one thing straight. A hoormate can be a girl or a boy. There are actually more boys, I think. They just can't resist a fit toot with their morning coffee. <laughs> Lovely. And those guys who cheat. Why do you allow Hurmay Tiffs to intercept? I really don't understand. I love my girlfriend, no? but there's one can that a lekker pa fit that I just, I just had to most men, you know? And the girls who cheat. Girls don't spoil a long beautiful relationship just because another guy has a bigger tolly. He's probably a tootla puskak nair that will sell your skin for tuck. Lucky people have a gender. It's like a gay dog, but for gentus. It's like a sixth sense that makes a, a noise in your mind when a gentu or a hoormate approaches. He's a gentu. She's a hoormate. He's a hoormate and he's gay. And he's a tukop. Yo, imagine. <laughs> Sounds like me. <laughs> but why do people become hurmay tiffs, man? I think it's like a itch that can't be scratched. It's like an urge you can't get over. It kind of makes them feel better about themselves. Can't he? They're just making themselves look like a fit puss. Moral of the story, though. Don't be a hurmay. Be liquor. Thank you and for check. <laughs>